Manny Gamburian, making his way to the world-famous octagon. Manny Gamburian is a very decorated judo player, and he uses that well in the octagon to set up his takedowns and slams. He puts a lot of pressure on his opponents with his grappling skills, and he has a good arsenal of submissions at his disposal. Manny Gamburian, fired up and ready to go. Javier Vasquez, set to enter the world-famous octagon once again. Javier Vasquez is a Gracie Jiu-Jitsu black belt, a title holder in multiple organizations, and is a very accomplished wrestler. He's not known for his striking ability, but he's very crafty on his feet, and he may choose to keep it there. Javier Vasquez, ready to throw down and put on a show. Our tale of the tape is brought to you by the only motorcycles worthy of being in the octagon, Harley Davidson. And now with the official introductions, the veteran voice of the octagon, here is Bruce Buffer. And now, five rounds for the UFC featherweight championship of the world. Introducing first. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a judo fighter. He stands five feet five inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of North Hollywood, California, Mandel, the Andel Gambian. And now, fighting out of the red corner, this man is a Brazilian jiu-jitsu fighter. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Pomona, California, Javier Showtime Vasquez. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of this contest is Herb Dean. All right, gentlemen, this is for the championship. You've been given your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. Mike Goldberg alongside Joe Rogan. We are ready to get things started. Are you ready to fight? Manny Gamburian, Javier Vasquez. And we Come are on, underway. Swing and a miss. Over the top. Oh, wow. Looping hook there. Drops down for a double. Good takedown defense. All right, so they're back on their feet. Nice right hand. And now he's answered. Both guys staying in tight. Pushes him off with the feet. He lets him up. Oh, ducking in and counters that nicely. He ate that one. What an exchange here. He's got the clinch. Beautiful suplex. Oh, in the half guard. Oh, he gets reversed. And he's got he's side, side control. control. Relax here. You're fine. Relax here. Big right hand. And back to full guard. Back to side control. And into full mount. Oh, he got reversed. Trying to utilize the cage to get back to his feet. Going for over under here. Inside the guard. Side control. Boom. Oh, uh, that's a huge elbow. Half guard. Now he's got the mount. This is not good. Oh, good hip escape from the bottom. Moved into half guard. Just over a minute remains. Full guard here. He's got mission control here. Just about one minute remains in the first round. Side control again. 45 seconds remains in the first round. 
in the guard. Moves into half guard here. And back to mount again. Oh, we got reversed. Reversal. Very nice. Oh, my. He's in full guard here. Round one complete. A great display of grappling skills in that round. Absolutely, Mike. I love a good jiu-jitsu match, and these two are putting on a show. Got it all day long. Gets that back, you fight that two on one. If he gets that body lock, you gotta fight it off. You swim that on. Yeah, on the ground, you can catch him all day long in that triangle and that arm lock. You can catch him all day long. Okay. He's got it all day long. You just got. All right, let's go to the replay, Mike. This was well timed here. Just a beautiful slip and counter. And here we see some amazing anticipation with a tremendous counter. Solid wrestling skills on display in that round, Mike. Okay, he's tired. His legs are tired from trying to hold that big four. Jay pushed it. The beautiful Shandella Powell. Are you ready to fight? Are you ready? We start round two. On, this fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Beautiful uppercut. Oh! And again he goes for a ride. Okay, moves into the mount here. Good job, hip escaping there. Moves to half guard. Into full guard here. Passes to half guard. Oh! Nice right hand! He's in full guard. Moves into half guard here, Mike. Postures up. He's in the full guard. Wow, that right hand. Looking for mission control here. He's got it. Using the rubber guard. Vasquez is bleeding here, Mike. Oh, and nice body shots. Nice right hand. Big right hand. He's got half guard. Joe, let's see what he chooses to do here. Reversal. Nice right hand. Working hard to try to get out of this bad spot into his guard. Able to posture up. Transitions to the full mount. Throwing that punch. That wrist control. Just over a minute remains. Elbow. Oh, he gets reversed. He moves into half guard. He's in the guard now. Pushing his opponent away. Oh, he lets him up. Good sprawl. He's in the full guard here. Great job on the reversal. Big elbows and punches from the top. Pushes him off of the feet. Two rounds in the books. Three rounds to go in this UFC title fight. Joe, we saw that round mostly centered around the ground game. Yeah, it's a pretty interesting matchup on the ground, Mike. Both these guys are highly skilled, and both are looking to finish. You can beat him. Heavy hands for me. Heavy hands for me, all right? He gets that back, you fight that two-on-one. If he gets that body lock, you got to fight it off. You swim that arm over, okay? You swim that arm over. Let's take a look at the replay from that round, Mike. This was well-timed here. Just a beautiful slip and counter. And here we see some real power on display. Fantastic suplex. And here's a solid, clean counter shot. Those can really take a fighter out of his game plan. Some good groundwork in that round, Mike. And stay aggressive. Get that leg kick going. Get that leg kick. The beautiful Brittany gets us set for round three. Are you ready to fight? Are you ready? 
And we are set on, for the start of round three. This is a championship fight, so it is scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Pulls the legs out. He's got him down. Nicely done. Good execution. Boom! Half guard. Moves into full mount here. Oh, he got reversed. Moves into half guard. Let's see what he does from here, Joe. Side control. Into half guard. He's in the guard. Side control. Vasquez keeps getting tagged on that cut. He's bleeding bad, Mike. Half guard. He's in guard here. Pushing his opponent away. He decides to let him up. Oh, they're just throwing. Oh, they're exchanging here. Push kick. Oh, good counter. Inside with a clinch again. Stay busy. Follow up. Get him backing up. Make him pay. Cut him. You gotta cut him. Keep away from that cage. Keep going. Back him up. Nice knee. Control the clinch. Take down again. And he gets reversed. Full guard. He's got half guard. Push that knee and go past it. That's it. Very nice. And right into side control. Oh! Oh, another one he landed. Joey's he's got, the, got the mount. He can finish the fight from here. Thirty seconds remains in the round. Half guard. Oh, he got reversed. Posture's up. Ten seconds. He's got the mount. Full mount. This is not, and that signifies the end of round three of this UFC title fight. That looked like a tough round for both fighters, Joe. Yeah, they're taking some pretty serious punishment. I don't see this going the distance. Now, on the ground, you can catch him all day long in that triangle and that armbar. You can catch him all day long, okay? Good? Okay, he's tired. His legs are tired from trying to hold that figure four. Okay, push the pace. Push the pace right now. Good? Let's take a look at some of the action from that round, Mike. And here we see the takedown finally get finished. A lot of struggle to get that. And this was that nice counter, just perfect movement here. And here we see that exchange that ended in a solid takedown. Nice action there, Mike. He sets up, you get hands in his face fast. Fast. All right, hard hands in his face. Ariani gets us set for round four. Are you ready to fight? Are you ready? We are in the championship on, rounds. Mr. Round four. He ate that one. And oh, he he answers. Big left hook. Oh, big kick. Beautiful hook. Nice job, double leg. Pushes him off with the feet. Now looking for the takedown. He wants the double. Beautiful. Again, the takedown is stuffed. We got plenty of time. Great reversal. Postures up. He's in full guard. Reversal. Very nice. Oh, nice left and a right. You go now. You go. Oh, reversal. He's in mission control here. Pushing his opponent away. If he gets careless, he can get knocked out. Pushes him off with the feet. Wow, that right hand. Oh, over the top. And now he's answered. Oh, he's hurt. That one dropped him. Nice right hand. Well, it looked like he was hurt, but he snapped back really quick. Got the over under here. Great job on the reversal. 
gets reversed. He passes to half. Oh, he got reversed. Total control from the top position. Just over a minute remains. He's nice. past the half guard. Full mount. Under a minute remains. Oh, good hip escape from the bottom. Moved in the... Oh, he got reversed. Looking to pass. Oh, he's got the mount. This is not good. They have worked into the deep waters. Four rounds complete. One round remains in this UFC title fight. A lot of great groundwork in the fourth, Joe. Yeah, this is a chess match between two of the best in the world, Mike. Everything you're doing is working. He's loading up. He's trying to take you up. Good. Okay. He's tired. His legs are tired from trying to hold that big four. Okay, push the pace. Push the pace on Good. Let's go to the replay of that round, Mike. This was well timed here. Just a beautiful slip and counter. And this was that punch that was very nearly a knockout. Good action there, Mike. Now, on the ground, you can catch him all day long in that triangle and that armbar. You can catch him all day long. The beautiful Shandella gets us set for round number five. Are you ready to fight? Are you ready? This is the on, fifth and final round. Oh! Don't chase it. Your face. Over the top of that big right. Joe, he's got his opponent up against the fence. He's got over under here from the back. Side control now. Boom! Into half guard. Little rubber guard. Side control. Nicely done. Half guard. He's in the full mount. Good job hip escaping there. Moves to half guard. Goes right into side control. He's staying on top of him, controlling the position. He's got half guard. Into the guard. Got the double underhooks. He's got the double. Stuffed. Over under control. Now he flips him over in the side control. Under a minute remains in the fight. And he gets reversed. Oh, reversal. Oh, good hip escape from the bottom. Moved into half guard. Passes to half guard. There he goes. Back to mount again. Oh, he gets reversed. They go the distance. And we'll head to check out the judges' scorecards. Joe, that was a pretty darn good fight. That was an awesome fight.
Let's check out some of the action from that round, Mike. This was just an unbelievable counter right here. This is flawless timing. And here was that spectacular counterattack. Dodges that incoming strike and then bang! And here's a solid, clean counter shot. Those can really take a fighter out of his game plan. The judges have rendered their decision. And here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds of action, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score it 49, 46, 49, 46, and 49, 46. Declaring the winner by unanimous decision. And now, the new UFC featherweight champion of the world, Mandel the Andel Gambirian. Manny Gambirian captures the UFC featherweight championship.